hi everyone welcome back to the my channel my name is anil and in this angular video tutorial we will see that what is the module in the angular so these are the points that we are going to cover in this video so first of all we will see what is the module how we can make it how we can make the component inside it and how we can use one module to the another module also so uh, first thing is that don't be confused between module and model that the, they two are the different things now the first question is that what is the module in the angular so module is basically the complete or independent functionality you can say that as a project level let's say you are just uh, making a user module then in the user module can be a login functionality for the sign up functionality logout functionality and change password functionality all right so these uh, this is a complete module and the login sign up uh, change password and logout can be a component inside a complete module all right so now let's see that how we can make a module so uh, before that, uh, that let's just go out our uh, root module or the one of the single module which is by default made by the angular which is the app dot module dot ts here it is all right so when just open it you will see that there is some functionality which is imported already important at one class is exporting from here all right so main thing is there which is the ng module de decorators here you can see that this will be bind everything in your module so in the declaration we will see uh, we will uh, define all the uh, component which is related to our module let's say in a single module we have the different component like login uh, sign up forget password and this kind of thing so they all will be de uh, declared here after that imports let's say in our uh, module we just want to import another module or the third party module it can be possible that so they will be just imported here all right so in the provider uh, we will always use the services kind of things but as for now we don't have any service so we this is a blank all right in the bootstrap means the by default component which is loaded here so this is the app component which is loading by default this is the we are bootstrapping it the uh, app component here now let's make a module so for that let's go in the command line just, and just simply write here ng g4 generate module and module name let's say my module name is users and just hit the enter when just hit the enter you will see that a file and a, a folder is created here like this and these are the by default things like the ng model and the common models are which is used by the angular uh, internally so this is a by default module so we cannot use simply module like this so we have some we need to some uh, a component inside it that's uh, so that we can use it so let's create a component inside it so let's say ngg component and component name let's say my component name is login but if you just simply define the login here then you will see that this will be a part of app module not be the user module for that to make the part of user module you must have to define the prefix like user slash users even user slash login and just hit the enter and whenever you just hit it now you can see that uh, inside the users module we have a login component like this all right so when you just open it you will see that now the login component is a part of module and this is import, uh, imported by default all right so if we just want to use this module so let's make some changes first of all here like uh, right h1 and we can just write here something like uh, hello from login component which is belongs to user users module all right perfect so now let's say i just want to show this uh, component or module in the uh, ui level all right that's how we can show it first of all you have to go inside the user.module.ts file and we have to export it all right so just write here exports and it will be an array and you can just simply write here login as an export like this all right after that uh, we are just able to export the uh, login module in the 
login component in the user module but how we can just get in the root component because without without the root getting is uh, getting it in the root component we cannot show it anywhere all right so now let's import your users model inside the app so just write here import something from uh, users and you can see that the user module and just import the user model here and just use this import imp uh, user model inside the imports like this all right now we can use every component of the user module so let's go to the app dot component dot file and here we can just write here login model we can uh, place here so for that let's get a uh, let's get the selector of it and inside the app dot component dot htm file just we can just simply use it like this all right and now let's check the output now you can see that we got the uh, app component uh, we just get the login component inside the front of uh, us all right so thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video bye bye take care